Good morning. So today is Tuesday. Almost Tuesday, August 1st. That means I start high school this month. It's intimidating. Um, <laughs> it's currently 19. Woke up at 7. I've liter I literally like laid in bed for half an hour and then I went on my phone and um and change and let's go get breakfast. Been chasing dreams, but I never slept. Searching for euphoria, judging through the mud. This is my outfit. I'm wearing such a basic outfit, literally so basic, but it's fine. Um, I'm wearing a Victoria's Secret pink little like sports top, like workout top underneath. And then I'm wearing Brandy Melville sweatshirt, super basic, it's fine. Um, this is where it gets really basic. My Lululemon high-waisted white leggings. Um, they're really cool because they have like holes at the bottom. But I spilled something on them. Oh, you can't even see it. Cool. Like, right there. Um, and then I'm wearing pink Adidas that I'm obsessed with. They're so cute. So yeah, that's my outfit. I'm gonna do a shot of apple cider vinegar. I'm trying to do this every morning. It tastes disgusting. I'm gonna take off my scrunchie. Let's do it. <laughs> That's so gross. That's disgusting. <laughs> So this is my breakfast. I have Ezekiel bread with peanut butter, and then I have Antony, and then I have blueberries and water. So basically, I follow a lot of people on YouTube or like Instagram where they're vegan, like Tatiana Rigsby, Margot Lee, and many more. And it's like really inspiring. It's good to see like all the stuff you can get being a vegan. Like a lot of people think you just totally shut down your whole like you have to get like all new stuff for your like pantry and all that stuff and that you really can't eat anything but it's kind of amazing to see all the things you can eat right mom yeah and basically you just shop on the edges of the store yeah so my mom's cousin oh yeah so my cousin Jackie watched a documentary called what the health and it's basically about how um, certain kinds of food impact our health, uh, heart disease and cancer and all that, and diabetes. Diabetes. Um, it was pretty striking the information, and I'd like to do more inform like more research about it too. But basically, meat is one of the worst things that we can eat, and it's also really bad for our environment. It's the biggest cause of greenhouse gases. So that alone is enough reason to limit or cut it out. Yeah. So. So we're trying to, how do I put this? We're trying to be a plant-based focused diet. I'm trying to like yes. have that. My plan is to kind of do a week and see how I feel. Yeah. And then if it like really makes a difference and like just keep on going. Right. And one thing I will say, thus far, I, I did it last night, or yes, I did it all yesterday until last night until I went to my friend's house and we had pasta. Um, but one thing I will say is I think this will make us prepare food at home more because we actually know it's in the food and stuff. Right. Also, and we know it's organic and stuff too. And vegan. Yeah. Also, um, you really have to, you have to basically eat mostly at home. And almost the best thing about it is I don't have to do a lot of cooking. 
I really like that part. It's basically putting a lot of stuff together. Yeah. Like salads or like grain bowls, like the breakfast bowls. Right. You can make quinoa breakfast bowls. Yeah, that sounds good too. I remember yeah. Mr. Manischewitz doing that. Mm. So we're not like, it's very, it, it may be like controversial, like, oh, you're 15, you can't be vegan, but really we should all, like, we should all be vegan. And I'm not being like, oh, you all have to be vegan. Like, no, no, like it's your choice, whatever. Like I totally understand if people aren't, you know? Right. So, yeah. But the other thing too is, our decision. I actually have an autoimmune disorder. Like I never say it that way. It's like something's wrong with my thyroid and so I have to take medication. So people have always told me just cut out the sugar and I also don't really eat gluten. So, but I still don't feel great. And I'm partially lactose intolerant. She's allergic to gluten. So it's like, why not just, just cut it all out? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. So, yeah. Just wanted to explain that. Bananas. Hey, can I do it? Sure. This is gonna be so much fun. Oh. Just wrap it around. So. Tell me when. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. Dandelion. Bang. I'm trying to see which one I want. I kind of want this one. But I feel like it just tastes like apple. What? Should put broccoli in a bag. Okay. Kombucha. Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm done. Take it away with my card. Hey mom. Hi baby. You know what that's called? What? Success. Yes. Look at that. It can take us as long. Walking the the runway into great to great food. I don't, I don't know where I was going with that. Okay, bye. Hi right, guys, so I'm gonna show you a little bit of a haul. I, we're putting stuff away as we speak, so like I'm not gonna show you everything, but this is what I got. I'm gonna have this for lunch, so I'll show you that in a minute. I'm also having these for lunch. By the way, Molly dropped this off because my printer doesn't work. Thank you, Molly, I love you. Um, we got these spicy lemon zest little chickpeas. Vegan, let's go. Um, tofu cilantro this stuff this stuff says it's made in the same place as dairy products but I think it's fine coconut milk yogurt dairy free tempa what are these tomatoes quinoa kombucha more kombucha this drink which is really good focus not gonna focus okay cool Ezekiel bread oh these are really good they're better than normal chips um, coconut milk and almond milk for our different mo moods. That's milk for my brother since he's not going vegan yet. <laughs> um, peaches. We got so many bars and stuff. Like, these ones look so good. Honey oat bars. And, yeah. There's a lot more, but I'll show you later. <laughs> Hi, guys. What's up? So, I kind of wanted to end this video and just kind of do an outro and finish my thoughts. I wanted to say a lot of things that I didn't say and I want to get a lot across or get across a lot of points that I didn't get across in this video. So I'm just going to say them really quick. If you have any more questions, leave them down below. But basically a lot of people don't support veganism, which I totally, like I support that you don't support it. It's fine. Like I'm not one of those people that's like everyone should go vegan. Like everyone needs to go vegan. I did say everyone needs to, should go vegan. Which I take back because not everyone needs to go vegan. Like, it's fine. Like, it's your choice. Live life to the fullest. I'm, like, screaming because it, like, doesn't pick up sound well. My laptop. By the way, this is on my laptop because I was... Okay, anyway. Um, yeah. So, I support if people don't support veganism. I totally support that. If people eat literally meat and dairy products, that's it. I support it. Like, it's fine. Like, go for it. Live your life. It's not my decision at all. And I kind of just want to get that point across because I feel like so many people. Oh, that's what I'm doing wrong. Um, so many people disagree with veganism, especially for younger people. They're going to comment being like, you just like want to lose weight, whatever. This actually 
makes you gain muscle more, so it's not like I'm going to lose weight. Um, and if you do, like, if you really study, check sources, do all of that when you're trying to go vegan, then you're not going to do it unhealthy, you know? Like, some people have, like, lost, like, gotten low blood sugar. Like, some people have fainted because they tried to go vegan and just, like, try to cut everything out and just eat, like, vegetables and, like, that's not good. You need, like, protein and grains and carbs and healthy fats, like, all that stuff. Um, and my mom and I have re researched it a lot. Like, we, we've done all that stuff. So, if you're, like, saying you're gonna, this is, like, unhealthy for you, especially because you're so young, like, please just don't because, I mean, it could be unhealthy for me. <laughs> this is, like, why we're experimenting with it for a week. Um, but I just want to be, like, don't spread hate because there's already so much hate in the world and adding on to that would be like an overload and it's just like hate after hate after hate and what we're trying to do on this channel the movement on the channel is we're trying to spread positivity we're trying to uplift people we're trying to make people confident and positive with everything like we're just trying to like just we're just trying to bring good vibes and that sounds so like good vibes but like good vibes you know like everyone needs them in their life and that's what I want to really show to you guys and stuff. And I don't want hate on this channel. And I don't want to get hate for, like, something that's, like, my decision. Like, this is my decision. And you can do whatever you want. I can do whatever I want. And that's totally perfect, you know? Thank you guys for listening to the end of the video. I hope this helped you. If you're, like, going through the same thing, want to experience, exper experiment, 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 um, with veganism for a little bit, like me and my mom. Yes, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I hope it helped you. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next videos. will be very, very soon.